So hey my YouTubers and everyone in the world, today is June the 23rd, the time is now 9.15 a.m. guys, it's going to be a beautiful Friday all day. If you guys are new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below and that notification bell so you guys can see more of me. And of course guys, like I always say, make sure to go get a copy of A Day of Poetry, it's on Amazon right now guys. I want you to go get your copy of A Day of Poetry because it's so lit, it's so exciting, it's so motivational. And volume two is coming out really soon. So I want you guys to get your copy of A Day of Poetry today. Do not miss out on a great opportunity and it's affordable. Now, today we're going to be talking about three reasons the rebounding your ex will eventually become enemies. I know you guys are probably like, hey, what does she mean my ex and the rebound are going to become enemies? The reason why I say this, and I'm going to state the main reasons why, is because there's always that possibility when things are not like actually working out as they should. All right, so the first main reason why I say that the rebound and the ex is going to become enemies at some point in time is because the mask will eventually come off. Now, when I say that the mask is going to eventually come off, when you first meet someone, of course, they want to be on their best behavior. Of course, they want every they want to seem like everything is perfect in their lives. Of course, they're going to show you the best side of themselves. And that goes for both the rebound and the um your ex as well. But eventually, your ex the mask is going to come off. Eventually, that person is going to show the rebound, who they truly are, and how they really give it up. Now, if your ex is a good person, then, okay, that this may not, this may not, you know, this may not be them. But as far as your ex being like a bad person and negative and just always out of line and disrespectful, eventually the true colors will show up, guys. And when it does, the rebound is going to be thinking to themselves, what did I get myself into? So that's why I say once the mask comes off and your ex shows the rebound, who they really are, you know, whether they disrespectful, whether they're going to, you know, play mind games, whether they just stop caring about the rebounds feelings that all of that is going to come to the surface because they can no longer hide behind the person that the rebound wants them to be. Now, the second reason why I say the rebound in your ex will eventually become enemies is because your uh, it says well basically the rebound can't stand your ex's presence and your ex cannot stand a rebound's presence. Once they get to that point where they can't stand each other's presence, to me, I feel like that is a golden sign that at some point in time, they're going to become enemies. Now, the reason why they, they're going to get to a point where they can't stand each other's presence is because maybe there's some things that the rebound did to your ex that made them feel some type of way or vice versa. Maybe your ex did something, some things to the rebound to let them know that they're not as appreciated and loved as they should be. And because of that, Every time they come into each other's presence, they're going to feel some type of tension. They're going to feel some type of disgust. They're going to feel some type of dislike. And the reason for this is because there's things that has happened in that relationship that hasn't been discussed. All right. You know, it's like a person hurting your feelings on purpose. And then instead of you telling them, hey, you did something that hurt my feelings or you did something that I felt was disrespectful, you sit there and you bottle it up and you say, okay, I don't want to approach the person with the situation because I don't want to run them away. But if a, if the rebound is sitting there taking abuse, taking the disrespect, taking the nonsense, they're going to get to a point where they can't stand your ex's presence. And the reason for this is because now they're starting to see who that person really is. Now, the third reason why I say your ex and a rebound will eventually become enemies is because the rebound sees your ex completely different than how they used to see your ex when they first got together. The rebound has been exposed to who this person really is. And now the rebound is like, hey, this person is not who I thought they were. You know, he's he or she is completely different than what I was expecting. And now I'm at a point where I just can't stand them, don't want to be around them. And when I think about them, it's just negative feelings and negative emotions. Once the rebound gets to that point where in their mind, when they think about this person, they feel some type of tension. They feel some type of disgust. So they feel some type of dislike. The reason for that is because all that stuff that the that, that your ex has done to the rebound that caused them to feel some type of way, they held it in and now they're at a point where they can no longer help hold it in. 
They're at a point where even if they don't speak about it, once they get around this person, they just feel that dislike and that disgust because they know who that person is outside of the image. So as I said before, the rebound will start to eventually look at your ex in a different type of light. And the reason for that is because your ex has shown the rebound how they are and how they give it up and how they just don't care about anyone else's feelings but themselves. That's the true selfishness that happens out here. Now, the bonus for today, guys, on why I say your ex and the rebound will eventually become enemies is because your ex sees the rebound as a threat. Now, this is a strong possibility. If your ex is starting to look at the rebound as a threat, the reason for this is, be well, if your ex starts to look at the rebound as a threat, that's going to be a problem because now your ex is starting to see the rebound as competition. Now, I know most people are probably like, what does she mean? My ex is going to look at the rebound as competition. Let's say your ex is dating a rebound and that rebound is self-motivated. You know, that rebound is the type of person that goes out there, gets it done, looks for results, is persistent, is determined, is motivated and self-reliant and self-independent. And, you know, you know that that person could live without them. The rebound that your ex is going to start to feel like, dang, you know, this person is going to get it done no matter what. All the stuff that, you know, I done did to the rebound and that person is still standing, that person is still strong, that person has grown so much, that person is showing their real strength. That's going to make your ex feel like that person is unbreakable. Because out of all the stuff that the rebound has tolerated and has taken, if that rebound is still standing, your ex is going to see that rebound as a threat. Like, wow, I did all this stuff to break this person so that their life their life could be so hard and difficult. But here it is. This person is still standing. Your ex is going to get pissed off. Because now your ex sees, like, you're, you're the true weak one. Because if you feel the need to have to, you know, disrespect someone and you feel the need to have to break them down to get what you want, then that shows true weakness within you. So once the rebound starts to see that your ex is like this, and once your ex starts to see that the rebound is that strong, that's when your ex is going to start seeing the rebound as a threat instead of someone they want to be with, especially if, you're weak, if, if your ex is weak and the rebound is strong. So those are the three main reasons why your ex and the rebound will eventually become enemies. Those are three possibilities plus that bonus. Do not forget about that bonus. Like I said before, guys, make sure to go get a copy of A Day of Poetry Today on Amazon. It's lit, it's affordable, and it's motivational, guys. And as I said before, volume two is coming out in the next few months. So do not miss out on a great opportunity to get a life-changing book, poetry book at that. Now, like, comment, subscribe, and make sure to visit my website, adaycreations.com, guys. It's always in the description down below. And until the next video, guys, peace.